Yo, what's poppin' everybody? Thanks for checking out the video. It's your boy Eo, and today we are back with a brand new video. Today we're going to be showcasing um, Tsunade, okay? This is the Tsunade that was just recently um, added onto the game. And yes, I'm not going to be limit breaking, not limit breaking, um, Blazing Awakening her because I feel that she has a better... She has a better card as a regular 6 star because of her abilities. Yes, I don't have any abilities, but um, I don't know if I'm going to summon again on this banner. Hopefully not, but if I am, I might go for abilities um, as well as abilities for the other Blazing Bash units. But for today, we're just going to focus on her. Alright, so let's just do a quick rundown on her. She's 80 cost, body type, uh, 1590 is her health. Attack is 2592, but I did give her the pills, so she she has 1890 as her attack, 2692 as her no, 1890 as her health, 2692 as her attack. She's short range. Her field skill, God damn it, it's not an ego video. If something no go wrong, right? Her field skill reduces the chance of being chakra sealed by 25 to 30 percent, and then her buddy skill restores 250 HP. So she's healing as a buddy unit, alright? For her jutsus though, for 4 chakra, 4.2 times attack in body damage to one enemy, 40% chance of attack reduction for 5 turns, and mobilization for 2 turns, and knocks them back. Alright, so let's see what this jutsu is looking like. I think it's an uppercut, right? Oh no, it's the kick from heaven. The heaven, heavenly kick, something like that. And then we have for 8 chakra, 11.6 times attack and body damage to one enemy, removes the barrier, perfect dodge, ignore substitution, and knocks them back, restoring 1500 HP. So this one's the uppercut to heaven. That's what I'm calling it, the, upper, the uppercut to heaven. Alright, so her abilities really do complement her, her last ninjutsu, well her ultimate ninjutsu, the last ability right here. This one boosts healing from jutsus by 1000. And the only jutsu that she has that heals is her ultimate ninjutsu that restores 1500 HP. But with this ability unlocked, she will be doing 2500 HP for her jutsu, doing damage, which is 11.6 times. And then she also will um, heal for 2500 HP. Now her other abilities are really cool as well. First and third ability gives a restoration, restoration of 250 HP combined. It will be 500 HP self-healing to herself. The second ability nullifies type disadvantage when attacking. So she will be doing 11.6 times attack to skill units with that ability unlocked. And I'm actually happy that it's the second ability, not the last one. So that is clutch. And then her fourth ability is something that I think the Sage Mode Naruto has. Which, the, uh, her nit, well for Sage Naruto it's his ultimate ninjutsu. But for this one it's her normal jutsu hitting all enemies in range. So the first chakra, the four chakra jutsu, instead of, hitting, instead of hitting one enemy, it'll hit everyone in range, okay? So, yeah. Um, pretty good so far, all right? Um, her, her sync skills, sync with leaf, immune to jutsu ceiling, sync with short range, immune to immobilization, <clears throat> all right? So, pretty decent all in all. Her PvP stats aren't that incredible. Her PvP form, the Blazing Awakened form, isn't that incredible either. So it's best if you got Tsunade guys, leave her as a regular 6 star user in your missions. Or you can Blazing Awaken her and feel her, feel her uh, in PvP and see how well she does. And you know, everyone has their own you know opinion on characters. So, so her HP for PvP is 33,690, attack is 4247, speed is 130, 131. Which is which is atrocious with the thirty uh, with the thirty increase speed with the pills it'll be one sixty one still pretty bad it's under two hundred not fast whatsoever so let's jump into this we're just going to be doing a trial a trial mission because um there's no mission that I really want to take on right now so yeah let's just take on this trial do some trial coins for limit breaking why not right so. Um, since we're already here, let me just give you a quick rundown on her abilities as a Blazing Awakened form. Alright, so, first one is a 20% chance to erase chakra consumption for her normal jutsu. The second one reduces damage from heart enemies by 15%, which is stupid. She's already a body type. Third one boosts the mobilization rate by 10. Fourth one reduces damage taken by 10. And then the last one boosts speed by 30, which her speed is 184 with the 30. 
it'll be what uh 214 and then plus the 30 speed it'll be 244 it's still bad still bad still bad all right so let's see what her normal hit does 44 13 not bad not bad at all um we're going to do her jutsu next see what she does for her jutsu it was what um it was 4.2 times attack and body damage so let's kill this guy so let's use our jutsu all right let's see what tsunade does without any boosts 18,500 i don't know what the last two numbers were but 18,000 8.18.5k 8 damage not that bad okay it's not bad at all i i actually like that it's pretty good for a regular ninjutsu you know we're gonna keep one guy alive let's try to get her ultimate ninjutsu actually let's play this through um okay so i think jiraiya has like a field skill i think that's healing or is that an attack buff oh oh it it's an attack buff. Okay, so it is an attack buff. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it is an attack buff. I think. I'm not too sure. Don't quote me. So let's see. Um, this is going to kill, obviously. We're going to see how well she does. We're going to put Jiraiya next to her, the enemy. And then we're going to attack with her. So, yeah. Let's see how well she does. We're going to kill one by one. Alright, let's put Jiraiya. Hopefully, like... Okay, alright. Space yourselves out, guys. Alright, hopefully one of them survives. Because I want to see what Tsunade is capable of doing. And of course. Oh, okay, cool. So. 40. Hey, was that a crit? Was that a crit? Oh, uh, we got the stupid uh, Konohamaru. I've, I haven't done this trial mission in a while, guys. So. Yeah. We got the attack debuff on Tsunade. That's fine, though. We're going to go in the corner and try to get our attack back up while we just beat up Konohamaru. I'm more focused to use the ultimate ninjutsu with Tsunade. Okay, this isn't no 150 boost because I don't have units to give her the 150 boost. So, just got to wait for the boy Shiny to do that. I only have... Who do I have? I don't, You know what? This, this, this right here. You need to go. I only have... Um, Obito, and that's not enough. Yeah, let's get Konohamaru out of here. Because I'm not trying to get attack. My attack lord. Okay, no crit. Let's see. 48.66. She did 48.66, guys. With the attack buff from Jiraiya. 48.66. And she does 44.13 by herself. Okay, so it is a 300 attack buff. Alright, so. Let's kill. So far... If it would have been so much better. It's so much better if like we had the abilities unlocked, dude. All right, let's see what the girl does with the attack boof. Uh, the, uh, God, you know what? Boof is gonna be my new word, guys. All right, the attack boof. I don't care. Let's see plus three hundred attack boof. <laughs> it sounds so stupid. Yo, fifty. What? What was that? Fifty five. Fifty five k. Boy, fifty five k with the. So, minus the 300, 51k. No, 52k. Stupid. 52k, 51, 52. I didn't really see the number that it showcased, but 55k with the buff. Um, and 52k without the buff. Dude, I'm kind of curious to know what is what her crit's going to be like. But, you know, guys, this is just the PvE version. I'm not going to Blaze and Awaken her because I don't want to Blaze and Awaken her. She's a good unit, all right? Don't get me wrong. She's a great unit, though. Wow. She's a great... You know what? She's right in my homepage. She is a really good unit, guys. So, I'd say go summon for her. Uh, people are saying that this is just a rinse and repeat unit. Uh okay uh what body unit do we have that does self healing like this i don't remember okay we got we got killer b mm, we got killer b actually we have killer b and i think he does more oh yeah uh so it's up to you guys you know you can summon or you cannot 
I might just drop a summon or not video as well, so watch out for that video. Make sure you go check out Jiraiya's video. I didn't do a complete breakdown of his card. I just went straight into like PvP. You guys will just see what he's capable of doing on PvP. It's not really worth doing it on PvE because like, like I said, I Blazing Awakened him. So yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. Smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next video. It's been your boy Ego. One love. Peace. Monkey